を始めますか今日のテーマは白玉まずは卵はいストップここに注目卵のための卵ポケットここをめがけて次はお湯はいここが勝負白身に優しくてほら白玉これでもうできたも当然あとは待つのみじゃあレッツ白玉チキンラーメン知らなかった日清 Hello everybody and welcome back with CAC. Today's video we're going to be looking at Nissin Chicken Ramen, which is、uh, sort of like the original chicken ramen. And we have the pack here.、Um, some of you may be familiar with the brand and、um, the make of this.、Uh, and if not, you might recognize the little mascot down here that's Hiyuko chan,、uh, who some people think is either really cute or rather creepy looking,、uh, depending on your viewpoint.、Um, So, we're going to be trying this today, seeing what it's like. And this,、um, I'm going to make it sort of like as close to the traditional way as possible, which is、uh, if you look here, you break an egg on top of the、uh, noodle bowl here, because the, the noodles themselves are a little bowl shape. You see, there's a little dent in the middle to put your egg into. Um, now, unlike most instant noodles that you might be familiar with,、um, there's no separate sachet to add the chicken flavour onto. It's already infused into the noodle block here. Sorry for all the crinkling, I shouldn't be doing it while speaking.、Um, it's infused into the noodles, so we don't have to worry about、uh, putting in a powdered stock.、Um, So, it's basically made to be as easy as possible. You just put it in your bowl, put the egg on top, and then put in the water and just wait. So,、um, given that it's that easy to do,、uh, we're going to go、uh, do that now. So,、uh, let's go. Have returned with my bowl ready, well, waiting for it all to soak up. And in the meantime, while we wait for that,、uh, a thought occurred to me.、Um, I know some people tend to think,、um, well, if these things are pre flavored, then、um, why not just snack on the raw noodles? Because I know that、um, I'm definitely not the only person who likes the crunch of raw noodles. Well, In Japan, they do. You can get、uh, lots of little bags of dry ramen noodles, which are just、um, coated with different flavors, which are intended to just be eaten dry.、Mm. Like,、um, just like potato snacks. So, yeah,、um, you could very much just take the entire disc out of the bag and just. Eat it dry. <laughs>、mm, and it's still just as tasty. Nice. Okay, so we've taken the top off of the noodles here, so let's just do a quick look at the inside of the bowl.、Whoop. Okay, we've got the egg there, that's gone all nice. I've added some edamame and、uh, 
chicken slices uh, just for variety and as you can see the noodles have absorbed and spread out to fill the bowl so uh, we're gonna do the tasting of this now okay so most of the egg sort of stays on top in the little bowl area but some of it spreads out and actually mixes with and coats the noodles a little bit so it can be a little bit stringy but it's the middle bit here that usually stays fairly soft yeah like a dippy egg lovely and then you can stir that in with your noodles lovely lovely okay so let's woo they're still quite stuck together I don't think they've quite um, absorbed all the water mmm strong rich brothy flavors of those yeah very very strong and meaty a lot better than any kind of noodles with flavor sachets in oh and you can taste the egg mixed in with them mm. still a little bit crunchy on the top but that's not a bad thing to me because i do like crunch let's have oops some of this egg here see how that's come out Mm. Yeah, very nice and soft, and you can see it is mixed in with the noodles. I don't know. I don't know if I can get them up to the camera enough, but I kind of coat the noodles a little bit there to give it some extra flavour and texture. Mm, yes, definitely lovely. Um, the edamame, I think, is just. It has absorbed a little bit of the flavour, but mostly edamame is just edamame. And let's try the broth itself. Oh yes, very strong. <laughs> and it's um, <clears throat> yeah, a lot, a lot stronger and a lot more robust than usual packet noodle mix. Looks so, yeah. Um, I mean, there's not much you can do wrong with instant noodles, to be honest, but this does everything right. It's just a really, really good flavour, nice decent sized portion, and for convenience sake, it really is just, you know, really good. So, yeah. I don't know if you're able to get a hold of them. Again, Japanese brands harder to come by, and it did take quite a lot of searching to track these down, um, despite being like the popular original brand. So, um, whether or not you can track them down might be the issue of you getting a hold of them. Um, I have seen them sold in, um, well, on websites such as Starry Mart, Oriental Mart, and uh, Japan Hall but I don't know how limited a quantity they have. But um, either way, if you are able to try them, uh, track them down, then uh, give them a try. Uh, I do think it is worth it. So um, yeah, I am going to finish this for the rest of my dinner. And um, that is all for today's video. So thank you for joining me. Thank you for watching. And I will see you in the next one. Bye. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. Leave a comment on video with your thoughts and what you'd like to see. If you like my stuff, hit subscribe and help hit my channel's goals. And don't forget to share. Tell your friends and help me hit my current sub goals so I can give back to you guys too. See you next time.